Welcome back, YouTube. Trying a new intro for today. You can't see, but dun dun dun. Now you can. No humor for that one, but yeah. And I forgot to turn on my second monitor, so give me a extend. Do, 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 do. And yeah, man, oh man, just and there we go. New intro for today. Yeah, why did I? Why do I feel this is too far away now? <laughs> it's fine yesterday. I was like not today. It's weird. I don't know. I just feel too far away from it for some reason. Uh, I don't know. Why move? Eh, whatever. I don't know, it's just weird. And also, I can't see my microphone in the video, so that's fun. I mean, you can kind of tell what it is, but whatever. Intro, funny intro, done. Good, one minute done. What I wanted to say was, I saw a video in the, I want to say the right side, okay, I was watching a video and it suggested me on the right side and it caught my eye, didn't read the title, I saw the uh, profile photo. <laughs> God, I'm so tired right now. Uh, video, photo, of whatever. Clicked it. And then I discover that... Oh, it's a tarot reading. New person that I never was subscribed to before. Video was suggested. The photo caught my eye. Clicked it. And then, everything made sense. Meaning, confirmation of a post that I did mm, some time ago. And so I found this. The only cat. Well, you... what? Don't know if you've heard of that. Secret at me. Well, you... okay, I need to move this out of your way, apparently. Come on. I'm... stop distracting me, cat. Okay. Done. Sorry about that. Okay. Video was suggested. I saw the photo. It caught my eye. And then everything made sense. Sync when sync. Can't say the word. Sync the the fell. Meaning, I made this post about. Archangel Michael coming into uh, me in a trance and we exchanged words, something happened, I recorded it down via a, a little prayer that I wrote, personally, that I wrote. And then to find that this new video that was suggested to me talked about basically the same thing that I did and then the stars aligned. Okay, the stars aligned and everything made more sense. And so basically the photo was 
app that I saw that suggested me the video was four pairs of wings, blue, white, purple, and green. I went with blue because it's my favorite color, of course. Didn't know it was linked to the Archangel Michael in that particular tarot reading that this person was doing. I was going to go with purple and or green, but I went with blue first and the stars aligned. It the reading talked about basically the same thing that I did previously in my own words. Uh, so what happened? Archangel Michael, uh, I saw the sword, the pow power sword in other words, uh, to cut you loose from your past or negative people, negative energies, the sword you will also use. The sword is there for you to use as well, not just Archangel Michael. And um, her reading basically talked about the same thing, except mine was more vivid, my experience. I don't know if I wrote down the whole experience, except for the prior part. No, I, it's probably, no, I actually did write the trans vision with the, in the description of the post that I made on Instagram, I believe. But again, it's just, the, what happened was, I saw the sword, uh, I was basically there with Archangel Michael and we were talking about move on, move forward, let go of the past, let go of the negative energies, use this sword to help you rise up, to be more empowered. And and now after listening to this video post, it confirmed what I was feeling at that time, only to rediscover what I had happened to me in a new video from a new person and the stars aligned. Confirmed what I have been doing, what I have been feeling, thinking, etc. The bells are going off, and meaning, do you see the signs? Are you aware of it? Ding, ding, ding. And now, I, it was confirmed, and, uh, well, more powerful than we give ourselves credit for. I mean, and I already knew this. Uh, the... I already knew the... The sword was to empower, to help you let go of whatever it is. Only to then be confirmed that what I was talking about without... Okay back up. The words entered me, as they always do, without me previously knowing about it. My post was before this video happened, which talked more about what Archangel Michael stands for. This post that I did was before I knew this. This is before my confirmation. And mind blown. Like, this is the first time that 
I am in the midst of seeing the confirmation, the synchronous, this in sync, and boom, like wow. I, it's hard to、uh, explain to.、Uh, as I, I said this previously, the higher the knowledge is, the harder it will be to get it out, to explain as crystal clear. And I feel I am stumbling in this video. So I had to back up a bit, but that's just how my brain works. It's sometimes out of order, other times it comes out very fluidly. This is one of those times where I, where I am stumbling as I am explaining, even though I am doing the best I can and getting the information out, even though it should be clear. However, I am stumbling because it's it's a first for me to express to explain something like this because this is a first for me. So I just wanted to be clear as I can on that note. Um. The other two wind colors, which are purple and green, it it also went hand in hand with the first pair of winds of what I have been feeling. However, I did not go past the introduction of what these archangels stand for.、Uh, it was Gabriel and I believe Ariel. The other two, not so much Raphael, I believe. I would have to go back to that video, but I'm pretty sure it was Gabriel and Ariel, not so much Raphael. Not entirely sure, but、uh, I will leave the video that confirmed what I did, what's brought me to do this video, and the. Uh, the description or the pinned comment, whatever I do.、Um, I'm trying to、um, tap into something right now to see if there's more that I need to say right now. Okay, there was something coming through. I believe it is Archangel Michael that I am letting his energy flow through me. I do see a pair pair of wings. Can't tell the, if the wings are mine or it's his. I do see the sword. That I made from from my post,、uh, for me the Archangel Michael sword that I see in my mind is just a standard hilt handle, and the blade is gold, maybe shimmering gold, meaning white core, but it's glowing gold. Yeah, that's it. That's it.、Um, Regular sword, but it's glowing with gold on the edge. Whatever that yeah means to you,、uh, to me it's just empowerment. Okay, that is the matches. The matches that I am hearing is. It is time to let go of the past. Whatever is holding you back, let go of it. 
Break through the darkness. Break through the veil. Tear it down. Remember your light. Remember your power, your inner strength, and above all else, your magic. Use your power for good to lift up the innocence. Defeat and battle back the demons. We are at war. Remember your true calling. The time is at. Hand. Remember, we are at war. Heal your wounds, lick them. Rise up and fight with the archangels once again. Once more, stand with us. Fight back the demons. Show no mercy, for they will not show no mercy either. Troll them, block them. Do whatever you need to do to erase their existence from your life. Let go of all things negative. Rise back up into the arms of the light and of heaven. Rise up, back into five D, back into nine D. The gods are watching. We never left you. We were always amongst you, if you knew what to see. If you could see us, you did see us. We are here with you, in spirit and in the physical. We may or may not know that. We are in the bodies of men. Most of us are unaware of being divinity, even though we are gods and goddesses. But in the body of men, It is time to remember your light, and to remember your true calling. Do the angels work? Whatever that means to you. But ultimately, you must do your mission. The great work must come above all else, above all others. We are looking for the one thousand, the one thousand light workers. We are looking for you, the ones who are innocent, who are pure of heart and of soul. Who never gave up on the true laws, the laws of Enki, his way, his culture. You never gave that up. You never followed the false god, the demons, the devil. You never 
followed that. You are not evil. You are a real light being. Those who have stayed with the culture of ninety five D, who are not twisted by this three D world. To have fallen for the tricks of the devil, we are looking for those innocent, purity, those real divine souls. We are looking for you. Heal the call. Of the real gods, the ones who never lost us in your soul and your heart. For you, you still walk with us. You are still with us, even though you may not remember. You are still beings of light. You are still carrying out. The ways of our true Father, the true God. We are all cousins, light beings. You may call yourselves angels, dragons, fairies. We go by many different names. There are going to be false light, demons who are masked themselves as good, but ultimately, they are the work of the devil, tricksters. We are keeping an eye on all. We want all. We heal all. Those who have stayed with the real culture of the gods, the one you may not remember, because humanity has labeled us as evil, because the devil does not want you to know the truth. He does not want you to be free. He has kept you enslaved in this hellhole for a thousand years. You may or may not be aware of the time loop that has happened for that majority of time. Others have felt the shift. You may have. Then, used the word "quantum" to describe what has happened. The angels stand with you in your work. We are always watching, always there. You are not alone. You never was alone. The devil wanted you to think otherwise. The devil has tried to keep you away from your work, away from your light and of your true power. It is now time to take back what is rightfully yours. Take it back. Hold on to it. Grab it tightly, never letting go, because this is your power. This is of your soul, and no one can take that away from you. No one can change your mind 
but yourself. And the demons will try to persuade you otherwise. Demons are attracted to light. Moths to a flame. Be a well of who you help. Be a well of everything, every little thing. Become a well of everything. You control your own reality. Let your light be the most powerful and the most brightest it has ever. Ben, become a beacon of hope, a beacon to guide others back to the light. Become that person if that is your calling. Do this work any way you can. Any way you can. And now my eyes are shut. <laughs>、uh, end of the vision. End of the the energy that was flowing through me. Yep, my eyes are shut. I got sleep in them. Um, but that was the message from the gods, the angels. They are now back in me more now than ever before.、And、this is just one of those videos. Well, I was not expecting to do something very powerful, and it happened. Yes, the angels have spoken through me before. The gods, they have spoken through me before. I am their voice, but at the same time, I am also a goddess, a divine being. As I am a witch of light, of nature, and of balance, peace, not chaos, not darkness, not evil. My eyes are still adjusting. I apologize. Okay, there's a a new vision coming through. I see a pillar of golden and white light. White is the core, gold trim, beam of light. And I see darkness around it, but that's just how my visions work.、Uh, here are call of the angels of the gods. It is almost time. Hear us. Feel us, remember us, remember your past lives, and if you can, try to remember your first life, which was before you came to birth. Try to remember your lives before the time loop existed. Which is over a thousand years. The time loop was for a thousand years. Remember your life before that thousand year, which would be one thousand and one year. Remember that life, or before it, if you can. I see a a waterfall cascading down, 
and in front of it was the pillar of light going, well, a pillar, I mean, up, 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 pillar of light. The light faded, the waterfall, like, <laughs> I, I don't know how else to explain this, but it, like, pushed forward while the light was. So the, the water, like, moved forward. And right now, the, I'm talking about the base of the waterfall, so all the steam, it's, the water and the steam is moving forward. Well, to well the pillar of light was. Okay, uh... After the... Okay, so the water moved forward, now it's receding. The steam is coming down, up fading, thinning, and there was a man standing there. Okay, must be one of my guides um, coming through. I heard a horse in the background, but there is no horse. Um, Wait. Okay, the man that I'm seeing is Archangel Michael. He is standing there. He is... His face is, like, back, looking up. Based on how I'm having my head right now, he's doing that in the vision, and... His eyes are staring up to the night sky, and then... Okay, I'm seeing now through his eyes clowns in the sky and they are breaking apart and light is streaming down. So the veil is coming to a close that was light streaming down. So the veil is ending and you're now seeing the bigger picture or remembering something that you need to remember or do whatever you needed to do or are doing. Okay, now my mind is just remembering some scene from a movie like, Billy, it's not a part of the vision. Horse coming down the <laughs> shafts of light, and I'm pretty sure this is from a movie I've seen. Uh, so now there's a horse, the okay, white horse coming down light shaft to Archangel Michael. He mounts the horse, gets uh, saddles the horse rides back up into the clouds on that going back up the light shaft into the clouds and the vision concludes that part now I'm seeing a moon glowing blue uh, I see stars for some reason, I saw a sun explode, like, brain, what's going on? Uh, right, now I'm hearing battle sounds, war cries, and the voice said, we are at war. Remember, we are at war. Prepare for what is to come, prepare for the worst, prepare for the fight to come. We are at war. Do not dispel, do not give up hope. The light shall pre prevail. Darkness, evil will always lose. 
The demons wanted you to think otherwise. Light will always win. Purity will always win. Balance will always win. I saw a tree sprout from a seed into a full-grown adult tree. I'm gonna say an oak. I'm not really too familiar with、uh, types of trees, so I'm gonna say oak on this one.、Uh, could mean just the tree of life. It could be. I don't really know per se. So tree sprouted. It grows very fast, and、uh, golden fruit. I, I don't know what what's happening. <laughs> okay, I don't know what my brain is trying to show me this time. Uh, rye, the forbidden fruit. Now I get it. Okay. Okay, the reason is saying sprout your seed, which is ultimately forbidden, because the devil never wanted you to be empowered to know the hidden truths, to know about five D, nine D way of life, because he wants you to be a slave, to be. Lack of a better word, stupid. The devil wants you to be stupid, so you will not wake up and say no to evil, to whatever. So the tree, okay, the tree sprouted, golden fruit. Now I'm seeing shaking of the branches and the golden fruit fallen. And then, a person eats it. What was this saying? It's saying, take back what is rightfully yours. Even it is not forbidden. Take it back. Consume your soul's knowledge, your soul's wisdom, your power. Consume it. It's not forbidden. You were lied to. Remember this. Clouds part, light streaming through to the tree, through the leaves. Um, I hear birds. Uh, I saw doves. Okay, peace symbol. Um, I hear a hawk rising above the storm. Um. Don't. Uh. And then, flowers bloom from the the storm. So the storm pours its rain, and watered the seeds, and now you have flowers blooming. I hear humming, lady humming. And she says, "People of light, take back what is yours, what is rightfully yours." Groom, trim. Uh. A、uh, prune. Ah,、uh, that's the word. Prune. Okay. Meaning. Burn the bridges to these negative people, environment, vibration, energy, whatever is toxic. Burn that bridge, cut it out of your life, leave it behind, let it go. Rise back up into the light. Into divinity. 
once again we claim what is rightfully yours, your power, your soul wisdom, your soul knowledge. Um, now I'm seeing a rainbow. All good things will soon come. The bad things cannot stay forever. Unless you let that happen. Good thing, good things will come when you decide it. Well, that's kind of funny because, in my experience, well, I'm kind of just stuck here, <laughs> uh, in a bad situation, just stress. Uh. But then, that's about to change, so... It, it took forever, but it's going to eventually change. Uh, why this long? I don't know. Well, I can also say this about... How I wound up in a wrong crowd, yet in all these weird toxic messages and then all of a sudden poof the, it all stopped so the bad things events only did stop but I had to change my thinking for that to take place if that well if that has never happened to you I don't know I don't know uh, yep yeah one of those things that it happened to you, you will understand. Um, so 3D people will ultimately choose evil, be enslaved to the devil without realizing what is really going on behind the scenes. Well, as a 5D person, can see through all the nonsense they broke out of the matrix, but even then, they might be fooled by something we all have. I mean, it's part of this life. It's part of this existence. So, yeah. Okay, uh... Bouquet of flowers? I don't... I don't know. It's just a circle and just nothing but flowers in it. Um... Huh. Okay. Now I'm hearing dolphins and... Them just swimming alongside a, a beach. Basically, what it's saying, go on your adventure. Continue that path. Have your fun. Do not let the toxic get you down. Ride those waves, whatever that means to you, ride them and eventually you will become in balance, uh, in balance, peace, ultimately balance, not chaos, the opposite of chaos, and you will return to balance.
uh, rain, uh, storms may come and go, light comes and goes, but ultimately you hold that power. And I'm seeing still waves, still ocean, uh, calm seas, not muddy, not murky, just this stillness. And a word, relax. And now that went to a beach and you're just lounging beside it. On a lounge hill, relaxing, hanging out, getting a tan, being at peace, being in balance. Letting go of everything that holds you back. I see a pale winds sprout and fly upward. Now I'm seeing a sun, which just means a star because the sun is a star. So yeah, whatever that means. Uh, you are all stars. We claim your light. We claim your power, your passion, your magic. Never let anyone hold you back. Never let anyone take anything away from you. You hold that power no one else does. Okay, basically I think the vision is just going on a repeat cycle right now. <laughs> um, it's, it, it's good. I mean, it's a strong message for, for sure. And that goes in my eyes again. Uh, I think I am going to call it here. Because I can barely keep my eyes open now. Very bright. <laughs> uh, until we meet again.